Water plays a crucial role in plants' growth and productivity. Every plant needs water to thrive. And irrigation is the artificial application of water through various systems of tubes, pumps and sprays to help grow crops. There are various irrigation systems with which we can supply water to plants. Commonly used irrigation methods are the sprinkler, the surface and the drip irrigation systems. And in this video, we'll be showing you how we constructed the drip irrigation system in our hydroponics farm. So the basic things needed for this construction includes the drip tape, the starter of the connectors with fab, cutting edge pipes or mainline tubes, and the end caps. So firstly, you're going to connect the mainline tube to a water source. And in this video, our water source is a 2100 liter tank. So whatever water source you're making use of, make sure you connect your mainline pipes to it. Then secondly, Holes are made on the pipes in the direction we want to connect our drip tapes. After making holes on the pipes, rubber-like materials are inserted in the holes so as to aid proper fitting of the off-peak connectors. The off-peak connectors are attached to the main pipes and the purpose of these connectors is to help transmit and regulate water from the main pipe down to the emitter spaced along the drip tape. After inserting the off the connectors, the drip tape is then attached to these connectors and placed with their emitters pointing directly at the substrate and the bags to be used for planting so as to enable water get to the substrate and eventually to the roots of the crop to be planted. They are properly inserted so as to prevent pulling out when water pressure comes in. And finally, the end caps are inserted at the other end of the drip tape so as to provide a leak free seal for your drip tape. Drip irrigation system help conserve water, thereby minimizing water wastage and it encourages robust plant growth and it is an affordable and sustainable approach to watering plants in a greenhouse.